Hey, it's Rich, and welcome back to my Minnesota Native Plant channel. Hey, th another reason why to have a uh, native plant garden. Um, I back onto a pond, as many of you know, and uh, the wildlife that you get, it you never know what's going to happen. And tonight, uh, June 10th, is the night when it seems to be the turtles are heading out of the pond to lay their eggs. They've made it and uh, it's time to make their nest, dig their hole and, and uh, lay their eggs. Tonight we've got the painted turtles out and about. Um, I have noted four of them tonight that are out and about. They're uh, letting loose with some liquid and loosening the soil and digging in. This one's right at the edge of my uh, garden. I've got a little paver edge. Uh, between the lawn and the native garden and this one decided to move into the lawn and dig down so she's gonna spend probably a couple hours digging um, loosening the soil then laying eggs then uh, covering uh, that those eggs with that loose soil and uh, hopefully in uh, a month or so we will have a bunch of little turtles headed to the uh, to the pond so if you you back onto a wetland um, even if you don't uh, if you've got a little marshy area, if you notice turtles and things, a native area can attract wildlife into your into your yard, and you get to see things like this once a year. Um, just it's reason 386 why I've got a native plant garden, but uh, just really enjoy seeing this uh, wildlife. And the, tonight the uh, uh, painted turtles are uh, making their making their. Uh, their presence known here. Let's see if we can get old mama here. Old mama turtle. I mean just I hope we uh, the coons might get it but uh, I hope this nest survives and we get uh, a bunch of little kids. Anyways thanks for uh, sharing tonight here on the Minnesota Native Plant Channel. Take care.